Uh, Nick, it's been almost like watching two different teams this season, the first 10 games and now the last seven. Uh, how can you explain the, the differences between the two segments? Um, I think we're pretty much all up in our own heads right now. Um, I think just overthinking it, um, plan not to lose, and that's never a good uh, thing to do. Uh, I think at the start of the season, uh, we were real energized and um, everyone was having fun. Uh, just that's got away from us. Uh, hey, Nick, if if you had to identify one thing you guys are not doing to create offense, what would you pinpoint? Um, I think we're doing a good job, um, especially today. I thought we were breaking out well, um, transitioning well. Uh, it's just that sustained pressure. Um, you saw it. Well, my line had a good shift there, and then uh, the next line came out and scored. So I think as a team, that's how we got to play, just come in waves. Uh, we've kind of gotten away from that. We've been a, a lot of a one and done team. So uh, we have to get back to all four lines uh, just coming after each other. Yeah, Nick, what uh, makes the Senators a, a team tough to play against? Yeah, I think they're they're well structured. Um, they, were, they work hard. Uh, they definitely get up for the games against us. It's a big rivalry and um, we have to bring that same intensity. I thought um, started off well, um, had a good second period. Um, like they, we gave up way too many breakaways. Um, Jake really bailed us out a lot of the time. Um, we were in it till the OT. So um, we just got to find ways to win those games. I think you were getting out of almost a week off. It was sort of a mini camp for the Canadians. Is it adding to the frustration, the fact that we were not able to get a win during the weekend? Yeah, I think everyone's pretty frustrated with uh, how we've been playing and uh, not winning at all. Um, so it's it's up to us to find a way out of this. Um, we, have, we still believe in each other and uh, we still have a strong group. So um, we just got to work our way out of it. Brad, thank you. Probably your best uh, best game in the faceoff circle. Uh, are you feeling more comfortable there now? Um, yeah, it's been uh, obviously a point of discussion uh, throughout the whole season. Um, trying to get better, trying to learn more. Uh, it's a lot of the times um, just working with uh, the linesman, um, working on it in practice. Uh, I've, I've always felt comfortable. If, uh, some of the draws just weren't going my way earlier in the season, but uh, just take this as a positive note. Eric Engels. Hey, Nick, what makes you say that you guys are up in your own heads right now? Is it what you see on the ice? Is it what you're feeling on the bench and in the room? Is it all three of those things? Yeah, I think it's uh, maybe a little mixture of both. Um, like I said, I just like overthinking is a, a big thing in hockey. Um, I've gone through it in the last few games, uh, just trying to to, I'm just trying to play simple. Uh, I know we're trying to, we're not scoring as much as we did at the start of the season. And um, we know we have to bear down on those chances and a um, couple of opportunities to shoot that we're, we're looking to pass. So um, we just got to keep it simple as a team and just get back to the basics of what we were doing before. You mentioned the uh, the psychological aspect of it, uh, Nick. Is there something also physically that you guys are not doing on the ice? Um, I thought we've been skating well uh, both these games this weekend. Um, I thought everyone was had good energy. Uh, we were playing fast like we usually do, um, but maybe we just have to be uh, stronger on pucks. I think I don't know. Uh, we usually get to see the stats of pucks won and pucks lost, so I got to take a look at that. Uh, tonight, but uh, as a team, I think we can just generate more from winning battles and uh, transitioning quick. Thanks, Nick.